Jordan's Point is a major piece of Lexington history that is finally getting some much needed attention. City Council decided to move forward with a plan presented by Landscape Architecture Planning, or LPDA, last month. Lexington Mayor Frank Friedman said that Jordan's Point has always been important to the city. That was the main thoroughfare and the entryway into Lexington and all the commercial activities started right there. The plan is full of features, including a new footbridge that would connect Woods Creek Trail to the Chessie Trail and a new playground. But City Council will have to decide how many of the recommended changes should be made, where the money should come from, and when this major project will take place. Lexington City Council member Chuck Smith said that the project is hard to think about with the financial stress of the pandemic. The next <clears throat> three months are going to really, I think, lay out what next year is going to what what next year is going to feel like. City Council has not decided where the money will come from for this project. Mayor Friedman hopes that the city will get a donation or grant to pay for the costs, but he said there are some other options as well. Sometimes we have years where we have uh, better than expected revenues and we can use that towards the plan and implementing over time as opposed to doing it all at once. The one thing that city leaders already know is that they are opposed to increasing taxes to pay for the upgrades. But some citizens might be willing to pay the extra price. Scott and Karen Nguyen like to meet up with their friends George Kester and his wife Karen for picnics at Jordan's Point. They were unaware of the plan for renovation, but they would be willing to pay more for the right improvements. The only thing I wish they would do is continue the Chessie Trail. Even though the Jordan's Point project has a lot of promise, Lexington City Council has a lot of decisions to make before we really know what to expect. With the Rockbridge Report, I'm Mary Alice Russell.